Hello and welcome to the Suffix Slayer demo. This is an After Effects general plugin menu item accessible from the composition menu and the very first item you'll see is Suffix Slayer. This tool is designed to remove that annoying frame suffix extension added on to your rendered images. You have the option to select or deselect this plugin from the menu. If it's deselected, nothing will happen. But if it's selected, will then activate listening for when you render out an image. Let's quickly take a look at how this works. So let's go ahead and say here I find a frame that I want to export. I'll set my composition length to one frame. Then I can add it to the render queue, select a preset image export format, and a location. And as long as I have suffix slayer enabled from the menu, once I hit the render button, my file is going to render and make sure it does not contain the annoying frame suffix. If I deselect suffix slayer, choose a location for my video and render it, then my exported image will retain the frame ending. So you have the option to keep it on or keep it off depending on what you're working on and what your needs are. Two important things to note about the compatibility of suffix slayer. We'd support using the comp frame number and we also support starting from frame zero. However, we do not support starting from a custom frame number. This makes it very difficult to detect and rename the file. So use starting number at zero or use comp frame number for your image render settings. Additionally, many times when you render out an image, it will try to save it in a subfolder. Please uncheck this as suffix layer requires that you render in the base folder that you select. And also one important note, if we're going to render out mini frames, Suffix Slayer will never rename these. Because when you're rendering out an image sequence, you'll need to possibly later put it back together. So if you render a single frame, of course Suffix Slayer will rename it. But if you render many images in a sequence, you will keep the suffix. But other than that, you can enable Suffix Slayer, forget about it, and never have to worry about annoying frame suffix endings ever again. Thanks for checking out the product, and I hope you enjoy using it.